I need to start looking into Martin Lee. special caller breaking important news right here because where else mayor osborne thanks for calling in no thank you jonah you're publishing the bugle you're always fair to me tom sure but fair well that's my job mr mayor all i have is my integrity and i won't compromise it for anyone now what's this cr news you're revealing for the first time anywhere on my show well, after the brutal, cowardly city hall bombing that almost claimed my life, it's clear our understaffed police department needs help. And I want to reassure the people of New York that I am providing it. Aha! MJ's hunch was right. The place is crawling with demons. Gotta take these guys out, then have a look around. Okay, that's all of them. Oh, 
high security lock. They use these on banks, not recycling centers. Maybe if I can find where it gets its power from. Looks like I could override the circuit. I need my electric webs. Well, that did something. It looks like the circuits need a little more juice. There. Looks like the circuit's still stable. Maybe there's another junction box close by. Gotcha. Almost there. One more box should do it. Uh-huh. That's it! from Fisk's armory. These must be where they're planning to attack. Wait. These are Osborne campaign offices. All the explosives from Fisk's construction site. And lots of high-tech equipment. Maybe later I can recycle this stuff into some weapons of my own. Demons were stealing from Fist to go after Mayor Osborne. Hey, did you find Lee? No, but you were right. Lee's using this place as a front for the demons. Bomb making, gun running. Oh my god. And it looks like they're planning another attack. This time on Norman Osborne's campaign offices. We must have some kind of beef with Norman Osborne. I found an address here. I think it's their staging area. If I hurry, I might be able to stop them. Yuri, it's me. Take it quick. I'm busy getting yelled at by my boss. Martin Lee and the demons are planning another attack, this time on Norman Osborne's campaign offices. Are you sure? We've had a lot of false leads in the past week. Trust me on this one. I'm sending you the address of a recycling center. You'll find all the evidence there. Got it. I'll get those campaign offices evacuated. But if you're wrong about this, you're gonna help me find a new job. Consolidated shipping. A lot of guys. I should try to do this quietly, but also with style. I can use that stuff I found at the recycling center. Nice. 
Love using bad guys' own weapons against them. And that, my friends, is what karmic justice looks like. He's not out here. Better check inside. They have bases all around the city. What else can I find around here? Huh. Invoice from an auto shop. Pale horse rides. That's one expensive tune-up. This is bigger than I thought. Looks like the demons have an army. <laughs> As if one deadly glowing whip wasn't enough. I don't know what I was expecting, but it was definitely not this. These 
guys aren't kidding around. Hey, MJ. I think I stopped the demon's attack on Osborne's campaign office. Nice. Did you find Lee? No, but I found something we should look into. It's a place called Pale Horse Ride. Sounds familiar. I'll check it out and back to you. This is new. No, no, no. This one's mine. All right. I'm executing this son of a... Hey! That's not how we do things. Down! Down! Code SM-1. Whoa, whoa! Before we do this, who the hell are you guys? Code SM-1. Code SM-1. Holding for orders. Copy Code SM-1. I have a visual. Hold for Silverburn. Entrance. Solid eight out of ten. Nine out of ten. Release him. He works with us. Yuri, explanation, please. This is Silver Sablanova, head of Sable International. A private security force. Paid for by Mayor Osborne. Oh, the mayor has a pet army now? Next time you get in my way, I will not be so gentle. Go. We'll talk later. Okay, we're still best buds. We're not best buds. Well, that took a dark turn. Anyway, Sable has the mayor's ear and unchecked authority. We've searched that address you gave me, found plenty of evidence of a bomb plot, but nothing that leads back to Martin Lee. I'm working on that. Hey, MJ. Hey, so I dredged up some records on Martin Lee's other business holdings. He's got places all over the city. Huh. The locations line up with a map I found at that shipping business. I'll check them out. Let me know what you find at each one, and I'll work on building a case. You got it. I'm headed to Lee's office at Feast to see if I can learn more about why he's doing this, and what he's got planned next. Okay. Say hi to May for me. Wait, you don't think she's in danger, do you? No. Lee's only got one target on his mind. Norman Osborne. Another call from Doc. Peter, I wanted to make sure you're still available. I can't pay you yet, but I've pulled enough strings to keep the holes from the door a bit longer. If we can get up and running, I know this new version of the project will attract investment. Massive investment. Stay ready. Fingers triple cross, Doc. <laughs>
glad I was here. Demons were gonna overwhelm those Sable agents. This is Sable Control. What's the status of our position in Dutchtown? Demons are attacking Outpost Romeo. Send back up. Peter. So if you're running this place while Mr. Lee's out of town, who's doing your old job? Uh, me. But I could always use more help. You know anyone? Actually, I do. His name is Miles Morales. Why does that sound familiar? His father was being honored at City Hall. Oh. I talked to him at the funeral. He's a smart kid. He's just having a tough time. I knew a boy like that once. I remember it helped to uh, stay busy. It might help him too. Here's his mom's number. Thanks. I'll give her a call. Hey, you haven't heard from Mr. Lee, have you? No. Why? I'm just curious. I've got a few minutes before work. I'm gonna look around, see if there's anything else I can do to help you out. Oh, you you don't have to. I know. I want to. I should check out Lee's office. Need help with those veggies? I learned a long time ago, you're more help staying out of the kitchen than in it. Pete, glad to see you're okay. Hanging in there. May said you were at the bombing. I was praying for you. Thanks. I appreciate it. Hmm. This office is locked. How do I get in there? Quietly. I don't feel safe in Huh. Never seen that room before. Whoa! What the... voltage lines. What needs this much power? I think I can overload that junction box. There. I understand, but the account number is in Mr. Lee's office, which is inaccessible. I will call you back as soon as I can get that information. No, I don't know when that will be. That room I saw from the crawl space. It should be right on the other side of the shrine. The shrine in the photo is missing the picture. Looks like this note is for May. Lee really did care about May. Hope this means she's out of danger.
This is the ghost story Lee's father read to him. About a demon that could only be mastered through balance. Lee did so much for New York. I can't believe he was hiding such darkness inside him. Lee's journal. A key. I wonder where the lock is. Lee sounds conflicted. Almost like he didn't want to head down this path. Some kind of puzzle lock. That seems right. Oh, I see. What are you hiding, Lee? Lee sure is obsessed with masks. Is it a Jungian thing? Like, Lee's giving his powers to the others. How does Lee imbue these with his power? Bioelectric induction? Compressed phase shift? Can feel my power growing. Feeding off my anger. Father would say I've lost the path of balance that he could never understand. The only way to fight a monster is to become one. Oh, this is the folder MJ found at the auction house. This might help us figure out what Lee's planning next. Creepy. It's a burn room, wired to destroy evidence. Get out of here. Hello, Peter. Mr. Lee. I thought you were out of town. Did you find what you were looking for? Martin, you're back. You get that. Thank you. And heading off again shortly, I'm afraid. Just needed a few things from my office. You must have heard about City Hall. 
Yes. Tragic. Peter was there. He was very lucky. And an Osborne rally. I didn't know you were a fan. Well, what matters is you are both safe. Amen. But the bombers are still out there. Who knows what they've planned next? Oh, I don't think you or May have anything to worry about. As long as you stay away from places you're not supposed to be. Well, I should go. When will you be back? When my work is done. I finally got your evidence. Head to the Feast Center in Chinatown. What am I going to find? A nice lady named May Parker. And some really weird stuff hidden in Lee's office. But listen, he's got another attack planned. Where? When? Still working on that, but I think he's going to use something called Devil's Breath. Sounds destructive. What is it? A substance created by Oscorp. Probably a bioweapon of some kind. I have a folder full of info on it. I'm holding on to it for now. I'll send copies as soon as I can. Okay, we'll check his office. If the evidence stands up, I'll put out an APB. MJ, hey. Just checking in. Peter, hey. Can I call you back? I think you'll want to hear this. Wait, why are you whispering? Just in the middle of something. How about we catch up over dinner? My place? Oh, sure. I'll even cook. Cool. See ya. Wait. Remember how you told me about Lee's corrupting touch? I think I just saw it in action. How? Some perfectly nice homeless people just dumped me. Thing is, they had glowing eyes. And I remembered Yuri telling me something similar about the guard who released Shocker. So Shocker was working for Lee? Uh, it's all connected. There's more. But I guess we'll talk about it at dinner. Yeah, see ya. Dinner? Huh? What should I cook? Hi, Doctor. How are you? Parker! Exciting news. Come by the lab. Uh, like, now? This is my divining moment. Can't wait to show you. Cool. Um, I've got dinner plans. Can I come by later? Dinner can wait. You need to see this, Peter. Uh, okay. Be right there. Wonder if this means I have a job again. Guess I can stop by. Just for a minute. mom's earliest projects. We were trying to develop a bacteria that would dissolve all the plastic in the oceans. But we, um, well, she ran out of time. Like, if you have any ideas, it would really mean a lot. Hmm. With some genetic tweaking, I might be able to crack it. 
But I need a better equipped lab. And the bacteria only lives in liquid environments. Wait, my web fluid. I can keep the bacteria alive in my web cartridge. Yes, you should have the chemicals I need to increase its power. Oh man, the bacteria dissolved my web. It's in the cartridge for the webs I swing from. The other kind should be okay. Now I have to get to ESU without swinging from anything. Whew, the zipline webs seem fine. Well, I'm getting a heck of a workout. Gotta hustle. I don't know how long this bacteria stays viable. This is good practice for if my web shooters ever malfunction. By law, they have to dispose of their chemicals in these containers. Should be some stuff I can use. All set. Now I have to get to Dr. Octavius' lab to combine everything. My bad! I'll just take the subway, but the bacteria won't survive that long. Okay, now I just need to grab the bonding agent. And now the industrial centrifuge that'll get the bacteria out of my web fluid so I can store it properly. Just need to isolate the bacteria. Beautiful. I think I improved the bacteria. But I can only tell for sure back at Harry's research station.
should have my web swinging back. Let's see. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, sweet web swinging. I'll never take you for granted again. I hope this works. I remember when Harry's mom started the project. It meant so much to them both. Where there's a web, there's a way. There's the testing receptacle. Full of plastic. Let's see what happens. It's working. Not as fast as I'd hoped, but better than before. Probably needs further testing. Didn't get all the plastic, but it's a big step forward. Enough for Oscorp to keep working on it. They'd win the Nobel Prize. And it wouldn't hurt their stock price either. Black Cat's been here. She was doing this in person the first time I caught her. Or did she catch me? This can't just be some elaborate flirtation. Hasn't she heard of dating apps? She's up to something. There it is. That's Ty Stone's place. And it's full of priceless art. You're playing with fire, Felicia. I guess that's how you roll. Breaking news just in. My sources tell me the police are now looking at the demon. as the primary suspects in the City Hall bomb. Hey, Doctor. Hello, Peter. 
I'll be just a minute. Wow. Look at all this new stuff. We really need to get better. Where did you get all this equipment? Called in every last favor. Took out a few loans. It's like we're starting over once again. But this time's going to be different. You've been busy. Just getting started. You know, until now, we've been looking at prosthetics from the wrong perspective. Why restore people to what they were when we can make them better? Okay, I think that should do it. You ready? Everything okay? Damn it! This is all your fault, Norman, you son of a... Well, I know who you're not voting for in the next election. Sorry. I uh, have a habit of making bad jokes in tense situations. <laughs> uh, it was a good joke, Parker. Just a bit of an overreaction on my part. No, don't worry. Uh, why don't you take a break? I'll, uh, I'll clean this up and uh, get us ready for another test. So, uh, hope you don't mind me asking, but it seems you and Norman have a bit of a history. We were lab partners in college. Became friends. Decided to start a business. We both had visions of changing the world just in different ways. Wait, you were at Oscorp when it started? I'm half the reason it's called Oscorp. In grad school, everyone called us the O's. <sighs> Add Corp to that and, well, it is a catchy name. Well, why'd you leave? Norman became more and more obsessed with genetics. He started a project I considered unethical. And there was this... Anyway, lawyers got involved. I chose to leave in exchange for a settlement. But that money didn't last very long. I've relied on grants ever since. If this project doesn't work... Don't worry. It'll work. Uh, let, me, let me just fix this up. I'll brew some fresh coffee. Be sure to run a diagnostic on the control unit. Could be a short. Huh. No good. Gotta reroute this circuit.
Oh, why don't you do the honors this time? We did it. Next step, neural interface. That's a lot of work for you to do by yourself. Sure you can handle it? Apparently not, judging by today's debacle. Because I still haven't found another job. My funds are still... I know. It's okay. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. What's a few bucks when you're trying to change the world, right? To changing the world. from MJ. Doctor, I need to go, but I'll be back later. Don't worry, the work will still be here when you get back. Cool. Logic controller for the micro cables Doc's been theorizing. are awesome. So much more versatile. Simple AI that'll improve the prosthetics functionality over time. Welcome to the future. Prosthetic has a tiny brain. Cool. Doc dove right in with the intracranial interface.
revolutionary, but not a hundred percent stable. We need to refine this design. Sorry I missed your call. We still on for dinner? Dinner? Oh, yeah. I was calling you about something else, but yeah, we should talk over dinner. Offer still stands for me to come over and cook. Oh, really? Well, I like to take risks. I'm still out, but I'll grab some stuff at the store and let you know when I'm home. Okay, talk soon. All right, dinner at MJ's. Low expectations. It'll be hard to screw this one up. I guess I'll just freelance for a while until she calls. Okay, so this station collects overflow data from all the others. Yeah, God forbid we waste Oscorp server space. Anyway... Do me a favor and make sure it's running smoothly, or everything these stations do is for nothing. This isn't nearly enough server space. It's close to overloading. That'll trigger a purge, and everything Harry has will be lost. I can't let that happen. Wait. ESU has a backup server near here they never use. That can handle the excess data. But I'll need to realign the transmission dishes to make a link from here to there. Fast. The active receiver's easy to find. Okay, now to find another link in the array. Got it. Just have to keep doing that. What's taking up all that space on Harry's servers? It looked like DNA sequencing, but that seems beyond the scope of the research stations. It won't matter what's on the server if it all gets erased. Getting close. Should be in view of the ESU server now. Got it. 
it. Now I can initiate the data transfer if I hurry. Looks good. Hmm. Let's see. Looks good. Ah, too much lag. It's working! Everything stored successfully. Should be fine until I have Norman assign Harry some more server space. And he'll be glad to when he sees what the stations have been doing. Hey, MJ. All right, I picked up a bunch of stuff at the store. Can't wait to see what you come up with. Swinging over now. Prepare to be amazed. You are not going to believe what happened. So you know that address you gave me? I went there. MJ. I know, I know, but wait. What is this? Just listen. This is the address Pete found. Men are all carrying firearms. What is this place? That office. Might be something inside that connects this to Lee. Need to get back there. Huh? What was that? What dumbass can't put their shit away? Bet it was happy. Martin Lee's really paying the boss? Yo, Rick! Boss wants to talk to you. Get in here! Yeah. He we need to get into that office. Lee. Lee finances the boss's new Win-win. What are they building? Is this well, all for Lee? Hey. Careful. I heard something. Wait! So what's the boss doing with the money from this lead What guy? are they building? Is this all for Lee? Careful. Grave dust, man. What the hell was that? Well, that gas is going straight into grave dust. You got it yet? Yeah. Only samples. Boss is still perfecting the recipe, but man, it's got a kick. What kind of vehicle needs tires this big? Where is it? I swear I left it over here. Seeing things. Yo, has anyone seen the 316 socket driver? Wait! Where is it? I swear I left it over here.
Yo, has anyone seen the 316 socket driver? Hey, I heard something. Wait! Where is it? I swear I left it over here. Yo, has anyone seen the 316 socket driver? That guy's not going anywhere. There's something. What is this? Some kind of millet? Office must be to my right. Someone there. Need to move careful through here. When don't we get a new recent song? Seeing things. Hey, anyone pick up more beer after our last run? Protecting trade secrets. Doesn't want any word on grave dust leaking out. Still, Bill's paranoid. Who asked you? Get back to work. Pick up some more supplies. Not till we talk to you. Barrels seem important. Lost once a lot of them. Jersey swamp. What's in these? Boss, come on. We'll never notice. <laughs> You're right, Rick. Won't notice. Cause it won't be there. God damn it! I said I'll fix it! You got some stones, Rick. <laughs> Let's see if they break. A disappointment. <laughs> and now I need a new welder. For Lee, here we GPS trackers. What is Tombstone using these for? All right, boys. Time to move. Get the gear for my office. Time to go. Okay, I want to say don't ever do that again, but since I know you're going to anyway, here. Take a few of those next time. Nice. Thanks. You know Tombstone is crazy and pretty much invincible, right? Everybody has their weakness. Mine is... whatever you're cooking right now. <laughs> smells amazing. The chicken curry. Uh, just needs some time to simmer. No dumplings, I hope. You're never gonna let me live that one down, are you? Nope. <laughs> the great dumpling catastrophe. I still can't believe they evacuated the entire building. I know, and in January, too. <laughs> Your neighbors hated me. Yeah, they were pretty happy when we broke up. <laughs> Yeah. So, let's talk about what you found in Lee's office. Well, Lee clearly has issues with Norman Osborne. Yeah, but, but why? I don't know yet. But his next move looks like it involves devil's breath, whatever that is. Yeah, I'll dig into it. So I was thinking, what if we teamed up? You want to be my sidekick? 
like a spider girl? Spider woman. No. Woman. No, not a sidekick. A partner. Oh. Not again. Hey, it's your crime system thingy. Looks like a residential break-in. Charles Standish. Hmm. That sounds familiar. Oh, Oscorp CFO. Wait. You don't think this has anything to do with Lee, do you? Sorry to cook and run. Did... Did you just leave your clothes on the kitchen floor? Uh... Where do you want me to, uh... Just the couch is fine. <laughs> yeah. See you later? Yeah. Hey, it's me. This curry is legit. So what do we know about Charles Standish? Let's see. Chief Financial Officer Oscorp. Single. Known for his art collection. If Lee's after him, it's gotta be related to Devil's Play. I'll run a search on everything in that file. Let me know the second you find something. I think Lee might be planning something even worse than City Hall. So, are we partners now? Because it sure feels like we are. Partners! Uh, sounds good! Okay. See ya, partner. Police look like they could use some help. There's probably more of them inside. You guys stay here. Somebody was in a hurry. Spider-Man! You're hurt. I'm okay. But you gotta find Mr. Standish. Fast. Those guys in the masks kidnapped him and forced him up to his place. He lives in the penthouse. Top floor. Okay, sit tight. So glad you're here. I can't find my car. I sworn I parked on this level. Mm. 
Frank. Work here too? This building is serious about parking enforcement. Never touches the ground. Fight! A for effort! The elevator won't work, they know I'm here. But maybe I can sneak up through the elevator shaft. Should be able to make it up to the penthouse from here.
Tall building. Fire bombs? Seriously? Uh oh! Uh oh! Not good. Standish. Okay, now what? Enter your password. He sounds nervous. Maybe I should take him out. Need to clear the room before I talk to Standish. Clear. Hope Standish is all right. Try this again. It's safe now. What were they after? Just financial records. About Devil's Breath? How do you know about that? Why do they want it? I don't even know what it is. Mr. Osborne's been pouring money into it for years, but he keeps the whole project a secret. I'm the only one who has any record of it. Not anymore. Looks like they copied some records to a secure server. Payroll information. On a Dr. Isaac Delaney. Who is he? I, I honestly don't know. Down! <laughs> <laughs> Try to 
fall slower! Gotcha! You okay? Yeah. I think so. Good. Good. You know, as elevator shafts go, this is pretty nice. Hey, Yuri. You okay? Yeah, but I didn't get much out of Standish before these Sable guys stepped in and told me to back off. What's the deal? I get the sense all they care about is keeping him quiet. Because he knows about Devil's Breath. Right. Whatever the hell that is. I'm working on that. I think I just got a lead. A lead? You sound like a cop. Don't you mean... Spider Cop? Uh, Yuri? That's fair. Peter, what happened with Standish? He's safe. Okay, good. And the demons? They were looking for a name. You got a pen? Yeah, go. Dr. Isaac Delaney. Okay. Who is he? What's his deal? I was hoping you could tell me. I'm on it. Just give me a few. Oh, and before I forget, you left that tracker from Tombstones at my place. I'll drop it at Dr. Octavius's lab. Let you know what I find on Delaney. The enemy of my enemy is probably also my enemy, but I still gotta shut this down. So are you guys terrorists or criminals? I can't keep it straight. Nicely. Just got a call about a suspicious looking box on a rooftop in Hell's Kitchen. I could call in the bomb squad, but it's just some kid's science project. Yeah, I know. Budget crisis. Yada, yada, yada. So? <sighs> Will you please check it out? There's the magic word. I hope it's some kid's science project. Man, I miss those days. School projects are so much easier than real life projects. Requesting 
status report from Lower Chinatown. Over. Traffic control point Charlie taking fire from demons. the ones inside feeling left out. MJ, I'm at the first location on your list, and guess what I found? Demons? Give the lady a prize. See if you can figure out what they're up to while I introduce myself. I wanted some memento. Drugs? Demons. Looks like they bring in their buddies in shipping containers. Explains how foreign nationals with criminal records are getting into the country. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> 
MJ, call the police. All the demons are incapacitated. Don't forget to bring me a souvenir. an interesting tip today. Remember that barbaric beast named the Rhino? Apparently last night he almost escaped from his cell in the raft. How, you ask? Well, no one there seems to know, but they assure me he's been relocated to a more secure cell. Now, I'm no expert on Supermax prisons, 
But isn't the whole point of them that there isn't anything else more secure? I mean, he's a 700-pound maniac with an indestructible horn. If there's a more secure cell, why wasn't he in it? Situation involving a bus full of civilians. Nearest officer, please proceed to Rosevale. Felicia thinks she's toying with me, but I learned something in each of these scenes. Hello, cat. I think some big-time lawyer lives here. I bet she's after his client list to find me. Targets. Hate to admit it, but she's one smart cat. at the yards. Control. Checkpoint under assault. It's the demon. Hmm. Looks military grade. Weird. Spider-Man. So you found one of my recon points. Who is this? Wrong question. The correct one is... Can you stop the bombs I've planted? Mystery man's got recon points spread all over the city. This computer's tracking bombs around the district, and they're about to go off. I gotta move. These bombs aren't going to defuse themselves. Boom goes the dynamite.
find the last bomb. Game to you? Games are for kids, and I'm a professional, and I get paid like it. Guess your client wasted their money. Sometimes information's worth more than money, and I learned plenty watching you. MJ, what did you find out about Isaac Delaney? Check out the picture I just sent. Which one is Delaney? I don't know. Guess you'll have to go to the party to find out. Good thing I already have a costume. No one, those guys didn't even have licenses. <laughs> Mr. Call from Aunt May. Peter? spoke to Miles' mother, and she loved the idea of him working here. Oh, the poor woman's grieving herself while trying to be strong for her son. She needs some time to just grieve, and he needs to see that life's still worth living. That was a very thoughtful suggestion, Peter. The kind that would have made Ben proud. Felicia's keeping busy, but I'm catching up. Let's see where she hit this time. Aha! Cornelius Van Lunt's place. She's hitting places full of one of the... ...kind valuables. She must be working for someone. Otherwise, why not just steal cash? Huh. But, 
if you catch me before I hit my goal, I'll give it all back and go straight. My future's in your hands, Spider. in progress. Gotta stop it. Spider-Man! Try hitting me! Spoiler, I hit back. <laughs> Live by the beatdown, die by the beatdown. Close to her goal. I've got to put an end to this, and fast. This area is full of Wall Street guys. Target rich environment. There it is. She's obviously familiar with these places. And that gives me an idea how to catch her. is leading me on a chase, but that's what's going to help me find her. By feeding all the past locations into an algorithm, I can narrow down her likely point of origin. Bam! I was too late to stop her here, but one or two more locations should get... enough data to pinpoint her hideout.
Vehicle Control. Boss is requesting a status update on Sun's place. Outpost X-ray under attack. It's the team is. close to her goal. And I've still got way too big an area to search. Gotta narrow it down. Every data point helps. Who she robbed, where they live. Me? I think Lonesome Pinky lives here. Stealing from a country singer. She's getting creative. If, but I'm getting closer. One more ought to do it. Attention all units, active robbery of an armored vehicle. Proceed to two bridges, over. Demon's robbing an armored car. You can bet that money isn't going to someone's quinceanera. Heart to heart time. Were you not loving enough this demon baby? Dad who was holding? Mom not around? Let you cry all night? Died. Need to shut down the demons before more lives are lost. location should give me the data I need to find Black Cat. By my rough estimate, she's got about 49 million in loot. I reach her before she gets to 50 and she might go straight. Huh. Oh man, that's the gallery where they keep the Jade Tiger. That's worth a cool million. I've got to run my algorithm and find Felicia, quick. Found her hideout. Gotta get there before she leaves town. This is Stable Control. What's the situation? 
south of Houston. Outpost is under siege by demons. assassinate American citizens in a bomb. How is it possible that instead of being wiped out of existence, these masked criminals are still at large and still striking at innocent people like Oscorp CFO Charles Standish in their own homes? How? You're on with J. Jonah Jameson. Yeah, uh, my cousin's a corrections officer, and he says the demons they've arrested aren't talking. They clam up, won't even speak to their lawyers. This underscores a concern I've had about these demons. They're not regular criminals. They might not even be ordinary terrorists, although they certainly commit terrorist acts. But it looks to me more and more like they're a cult. Are you kidding me? Those kind of people are out of their minds. They'll do anything. It's horrifying, isn't it? Does this mean that we have to live in fear? To be constantly looking over our shoulders? To expect an attack at any moment? My opinion, folks, the answer is yes. We've gotta stop this before it turns into a massacre. Freedom Tunnel. Before Feast started, this was a haven for New York's homeless. Mostly abandoned now. Good hiding spot. Must be a hidden entrance or something. Bingo. This looks like everything sh Financial data on the Magia crime families. Is she trying to blackmail them? What's this? Spider, you raced here to redeem me, didn't you? You're adorable. And cute, too. Which is why I made you something more... flattering. If you've got it, flaunt it. This couldn't all have just been a game, could it? just robbed the police department's evidence lockup. What? How? That place is like Fort Knox. All those cats you found? When they were all together in the evidence room, they linked up, boosted their signal, and deactivated the alarm. No one even saw her sneak in. She knew I'd find the cats and report them to you. She played me. Again. What'd she take? Just her old costume and gear. She let me find 50 million worth of loot just so she could get her stuff back. Which means she's got something even bigger planned. Wow. Gotta give her credit. She played you good. Are you smiling? You sound like you're smiling. We gotta go.
All this for little old me? need a vacation or something. Dudes are way too high strung. up as a cowboy or astronaut or ballerina and trick-or-treat, but this trend of grown adults glorifying the likes of Spider-Man by dressing up as them is, especially in the times we live in, just... Halloween party. Guess I don't have to change. Uh, you said that they, uh, they're looking for someone. Delaney's dressed as one of my greatest foes. Let's find out which one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Costume. My people. Now there's a guy who puts in the effort. Badass. Dr. Delaney is here somewhere. I have to find him before Lee does. Broadway in Delaware, no culture. Huh? Hey, look at us! We're Spider Bros! Check out my moves! <laughs> Excuse me, are you Dr. Delaney? Oh, Spider Man, my nemesis. You won't catch me this time! <coughs> oh no, smoke. Whatever will I do? with you. I worked on that helmet for a week. I need to find Dr. Delaney. He's out in the party somewhere. Who are you? I'm your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. <laughs> Smart ass.
guy throwing down candy could be Dr. Delaney. Gotta find a way up there. Hey! Over here! Right, Can't use my webs. How could I get up there? I'm looking for Isaac Delaney. I think he's on the dance floor. There he is. The lizard in the lab coat. Hey, look, it's Spider Boy. Someone of your nemesis? Is? We gotta uh, fight. Maybe later. Oh, what's the matter, Spider Whip? You afraid of my mighty horn? Hey, hey, who? What, what are you? Come on! Hey! Uh, fight! Uh, Kick fight. his ass, Spider Man! Yeah. Uh, 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 what the hell? Oh, snap! what you want this is a joke right those aren't real guns back now <laughs> let him go Everybody okay? Yeah. Good. Uh, happy Halloween. How about some mood lighting?
And where'd they take the lady? began working with someone in an Oscorp lab. How do, you, how do you know that? We don't have much time, Isaac. Tell me his name. Show's over, Lee. Apparently the show's not over. His name, Dr. Morgan Michaels. Thank you. No! all of them. Gotta find Lee.
Yuri, I need your help. I've got reports of shots fired at ESU. Yeah, that's me. I'll explain later. But right now, you need to find a Dr. Morgan Michaels. Martin Lee's coming after him. Copy that. Spider-Man, who is this Dr. Michaels? I think he's the head scientist on this Devil's Breath project. Did you find him? Yes and no. Sable says they have him under protection at a safe house somewhere in the city. But they won't tell me where. I thought you guys were working together. So did I. Okay. I have an idea on how to find him. I'll let you know if it works. Hey, did you find Dr. Delaney at the party? Yeah, but so did Lee. Oh no, what happened? Lee corrupted him and made him kill himself. We have to stop this guy. We will. Before Delaney died, he gave Lee a name. Morgan Michaels. Morgan Michaels. Who is he? I'm not sure. But I bet he works on the Devil's Breath Project. Have you learned anything from that Devil's Breath file? Yeah, get this. A few years ago, Osborne came to Fisk and asked him to build a lab, but to keep it hidden from regulators. Secret lab? For Devil's Breath? If it's as dangerous as we think it is, I can see why. Where's the lab? In the file, Osborne made Fisk destroy all records of it. All I have are invoices from Osborne's personal account to Fisk Construction. Knowing Fisk, he kept the invoices around for blackmail material on the mayor. Everything leads back to Norman Osborne. Guess it's time to pay him a visit. I doubt he's gonna tell you anything. Wasn't planning to ask. at Empire State University. But this is not your usual toxic mix of underage drinking, entitled millennials, and hormones run rampant. Authorities are keeping a tight lid on the situation, but my sources tell me the demons drug the students, turning them into deadly rage machines. What has become of our fair city, ladies and gentlemen, when we have to fear our own children, our neighbors, our husbands and wives? Be vigilant. Be on guard, and keep a close eye on that barista with the man bun making your skinny latte, or you could be next! This is Stable Control, requesting a status update from Midtown North. Outpost X-ray under attack. It's the demons. Okay, that's how I can get into Norman's office. Can't get in there without shutting down some security systems. But if they see me, they'll put the whole place on lockdown. I should be able to hack into the security network modules from the outside. There are the network cables. Just need to follow them to the security module. There we go. A security module. Looks like there's four of these around the building. That should make things easier. What the hell? Security teams, call in. Sable Team Alpha standing by. Looks like an electrical problem. Copy that. Keep an eye on the exterior while we try to track down the issue. Just when I thought it would be easy. All Sable Teams. Looks like we have some sort of software problem. Target spotted. It's Spider-Man! Copy that. Continuing exterior sweep.
all stable teams. Looks like we have some sort of software problem. We're calling in a specialist. Copy that. Continuing exterior sweep. There's the second module. What? All agents. Someone's taking control of one of our subsystems. Initiating Delta Protocol. Man, everybody's got drones these days. Stable teams, I need a status report. Exterior sweep negative. We are all clear. Still look like a software issue? We don't know. We're evaluating. Please maintain current alert level. Okay, just two more modules. Attention all Sable teams. There's a small possibility we have a trespasser on site. We're analyzing data now. Stay vigilant. Copy that, Control. There it is. Damn it. Another subsystem is going offline. I need a team to scan the 85th floor exterior. Copy, Control. Bird inbound. Gotta move. Hi, MJ. A little busy right now. I'll be quick. Listen, I got a lead on Charles Standish's location. I think if I can get to him, I can make him talk. He knew about Dr. Delaney. He probably knows about Morgan Michaels as well. Okay, just don't do anything crazy. Speaking of crazy, gotta find that last module. There's the last one. Now I can get into Norman's office and hopefully find out more about Morgan Michaels and Devil's Breath. Exterior sweep negative. Should we go on lockdown? Not yet. Mr. Osborne is in the middle of an important call, but keep tracking. There must be someone out there. Hold on. Switching to a secure line. I'm way ahead of you, Wilson. I had my people go through all your files. If you try to expose our business arrangement, it'll be your word against mine. And I'm not the one behind bars right now. Wait, is Norman talking to Wilson Fisk? The Neo statue. What are you talking about? The Neo statue from the auction house. They must be talking about that file MJ found. Jackpot. GR27. Hmm. Dr. Morgan Michaels is the chief scientist. But the location of the lab is redacted. AI-controlled CRISPR? If that actually works, it could cure any genetic disease. Cystic fibrosis? Huntington's? This is crazy. Creepy. Whoa. GR-27 is devil's breath. It's designed to cure diseases, but in its current form, it's like a bioweapon. Dr. Michaels keeps the only sample with him at all times. That's why Lee wants him. We find Michaels, we find Devil's Breath. Get this. Devil's Breath wasn't designed to be a weapon. It's a treatment for genetic disorders. But its current form is wildly imperfect. In trying to fix the body, it rips it apart. We need to locate Dr. Michaels. I don't trust Sable to contain something this deadly. I may have a lead on that. Charles Standish is being held at Sable's Central Park compound. If anyone knows Michaels' location, it'll be Oscorp CFO. I'm trying to reach him now. Reach him? That place is crawling with guards! How are you trying to reach him? Very, very quietly. Gotta go, partner. Sneaking into a Sable compound. That could go bad fast. I should head up to Central Park. 
Like Doc checked in. Peter, I've had an epiphany. It's all about the mind. Take me, for example. A mind of unlimited potential, shackled to a tired old body. Think of what that mind could achieve if it were freed. In developing our neural interface, we need to think beyond replicating the tired putterings of our physical forms. Instead, reach into imagination and possibility. Reach into the mind. I've never heard Doc this excited by a project. He's not too excited. All units, officers are pursuing a box truck armed with a bomb. Location is Museum Mile. Over. you, MJ. Crap. Reach him! That place is crawling with guards. How are you trying to reach him? Very, very quietly. Gotta go, partner. Standish is somewhere in there. Gotta get past that guard. Time to see if these lures Pete gave me work. That gap in the fence looks promising. Just need to distract the guard. Out of the way, fella. here somewhere. Distract him for long. How's it looking? Convoy gonna be ready? Five by five.
Bravo and Charlie are both on deck for Dr. Michael's relocation, ma'am. At... Checks are clear. Continuing patrol. Might have something, Control. Stand by. Looks important. Safe houses. If Dr. Michaels is in one of these, Standish might know which one. There's Standish's tent. Can't believe Michaels just kicked off. Again? What's up with these lights? Sector clear. Continuing patrol. Who's there? I see something. Checking it out. Wait! Standish's tent. Can't believe Michaels just carries devil's breath around with him. Osborne doesn't. Again? What's up with these lights? Standish's tent. Can't believe Michaels just carries devil's breath around with him. Osborne doesn't trust him. Again? What's up with these lights? Could really use a coffee. Control. Wait! There's Standish's tent. Can't believe Michaels just carries devil's breath around with him. Osborne does Again? What's up with these lights? Standish's tent. Can't believe Michaels just carries devil's breath around with him. Osborne does Again? What's up with these lights? Standish's tent. Can't believe Michaels just carries devil's breath around with him. Osborne doesn't. Again? What's up with these lights?
Charles Standish? Holy crap! Charles, where is Dr. Morgan Michaels? Lee sent you. Didn't he? No. Okay. He wants to kill me? You tell him to do it. Do it himself. I'm not with the demons. I'm not with Sable. I'm a reporter. And I want to see Lee stopped. Just like you. What's that? I've read your byline. Sable won't listen to me. She has Michaels in the Bowery. They're moving him to a new safe house tomorrow at noon. But she's totally ignoring Grand Central. Grand Central? The demons were talking about it when they held me. They're going there to get... To get what, Charles? What do the demons need to get at Grand Central? <laughs> what the... Charles! Oh! What the that was hell? not a Sable guy. Definitely not a Sable guy. Heard Sorry, Charlie. Get the backup over here. Okay, time to Wait, go. no, he knows something. That was maybe the most awkward swing of my life. MJ is not happy. Hey, okay, another thing. Sorry, Charlie. You knock a man out, destroy my background research, and the best you got is sorry, Charlie? Is everything a joke to you? What? MJ, no, I, I screwed up. It, it was a tension breaker. Tension breaker, right. You know, this is exactly why we broke up. I thought we broke up so you could focus on your career. We broke up because you wouldn't stop treating me like a baby. Don't do this, MJ. Don't do that, MJ. Oh, that's too dangerous, MJ. I may not have super spider powers, but I'm not made out of glass. You snuck into the middle of an armed military... You know what? Can we not do this right now, please? Did you learn anything about Dr. Michaels? <sighs> Fine. Michaels is in the Bowery somewhere. Sable's moving him tomorrow at noon. Awesome. Anything else? Was he saying something about Grand Central before I jumped in? He was... No. It was nothing. Listen, I gotta go, Peter. Filing deadline. Peter. That's how you know she's still there. Peter. Nice work, Mr. Superhero. Man, I'm worked up. Gotta blow off some steam on patrol.
of our position in Dutchtown. Checkpoint under attack by Demon. A shootout. That's not good for anybody. It's the time for my special brand of conflict resolution. Mom. Hello? Mr. Parker? It's Leo Morales. I want to thank you for getting Miles the job at the feast shelter. Glad to. And please call me Peter. Mr. Parker is probably someone more together than me. I should tell you, he has reservations. I finally gave him a choice. This or more therapy. He needs this. He just hates to feel like a victim or be pitied. Gotcha. I'm the same way. I'll let Aunt May know, and I'll make sure I'm there his first day. Thank you again. This means a lot to both of us. Welcome.
Hey, sorry I'm late. Morning, Parker. Or is it evening? That doesn't matter. Check the neurosensors, would you? We need a faster response time. On it. Try to get it under three milliseconds. Okay, looks like I could optimize this power relay. Looks like some impedance in this neurosensor circuit. Finished. The signal to noise is out of whack. A new signal processor should reduce lag. I got it, Doc. 2.8 milliseconds. Good work, Peter.
I'd call that a mouse success. I'd call that unbelievable. Do you need some help? Yes. Doctor, what's going on? It's become that obvious. My doctors call it a degenerative neurological disorder. Probably caused by overexposure to toxic chemicals in my reckless youth. Sorry, is, is, is there anything I can do? You already are. The worst part is, it only affects the muscles. The mind continues to work, but... It can no longer do. You're the only one who knows, Peter. I'd like to keep it that way. Of course. Uh, if you'd like to seek a position with more of a future... I, I came here to work for you because of what you've got up here. And that's not going anywhere. So neither am I. Oh, Peter, before I forget, I read the most fascinating article. Outlines possible next steps for the neural interface. I'll take a look. Thanks, Doc. Man, direct interface with the basal ganglia. Exciting, but risky. I don't know, Doc. You'll need a gallium silk array to make it work. Even then, odds of injury are pretty high. Gallium! Genius! Never mind the risks. We'll work them out in time. Doc loves these things. He used them in grad school when he had to manipulate radioactive isotopes. Says seeing them keeps him humble. Doc's really sick. At this rate, he'll lose control of his motor functions within a year. And if we're not careful, an intracranial implant could make things even worse. Even alter his personality. We need to proceed carefully. Um, Doc, I'm sorry. My aunt just texted. No worries, Peter. I was thinking of taking a break myself. As soon as I check our telemetry data. Thanks. I'll be back in a few hours. Did it. Finished.
Hi, May. Let me guess. Running late? Nope, I'm actually on my way now. Have you heard from Miles? No, but his mother said he was coming, so... Good. I'll be there soon. Bye. There's a fine line between being a conspiracy theorist and evil. What are you doing here? just made your last mistake, punk. What the... Does it seriously take this many guys to rob a teenager? Spider-Man. You're the amazing Spider-Man. You're the spectacular Spider-Man. And a few other choice adjectives Jameson uses. Look, that was really brave. But next time, leave the fighting to the pros. Okay? Uh, okay, but what if there aren't any around? Well, you can't just go swinging at someone twice your size. I mean, don't get me wrong. I fight guys stronger than me all the time. But when I do it, I have... Oh, like that time you fought right on the Brooklyn Bridge? That was so awesome. Perfect example. If the other guy's bigger, you gotta be quicker. Okay? Okay, but that's it's easy for you to say. I, sorry, I just can't do what you do. All right, put him up. Seriously? Yeah, come on. First thing, don't let the adrenaline get to you. Breathe slow, breathe deep, relax. Hip square to your opponent. Let them make the first move. Now use your feet. When they go off balance, look for an opening. Boom. Like that? Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Not only this time, just let me have it. Right on the jaw. Okay? I can do it. Oh, sh... S sorry. No, no. No. It's all good. You keep that up and uh, you'll be fine. All right. Lesson's over. Gotta go. Hey. Uh, thanks. You know, anytime. I just punch Spider Man. Shelter should be just ahead. Yo, Miles, what's up? Bro, you're not gonna believe this. I just met Spider Man. What? That's crazy. Hey, did you show him our hacking app? Oh, man. I totally forgot. Oh, you suck. He totally would have bought it off you, and then we'd be, like, famous. Yeah, I'll show him next time. I, I gotta go. I promised my mom I wouldn't be late. Uh, cool. Later. Farmer's market. I can cut through there. Keep moving. Keep moving. Keep moving. Man. Oh, they're okay. Well, when you say it like that, how would you say it? Huh. Hacking it. I wonder if it still works. Uh-oh. Everyone have their IDs out and ready for inspection. Kidding me? It's gonna take forever. That drone wasn't watching. 
can jump the fence. Do you know anyone by the name of Martin Lee? Wow, that was too easy. I can't believe stable systems are unsecure. Maybe I'll send an anonymous tip. I think I'll stay clear of those guys. Okay, hacking app. Don't fail me now. Okay. Okay, time to move. Under the gate on the left, or over the scaffolding to the right. The scaffolding will work. Oh, more drones? I'll blind them. Those things have mounted guns? Can't let them spot me. So cool. It's less terrifying. <clears throat> okay, I'm in the clear. Phew. That was intense. Oh, hey, mom. Hi, honey. Did you make it to the feast shelter? Okay. Uh, yeah, almost there. Miles, you don't have to work at that shelter, you know. You said I did. No, I gave you a choice. Yeah, and I chose this over more therapy. I mean, it was helpful. The guy said everyone grieves in their own way. But this is mine. Okay, sorry. Mom. Yeah? Just because I don't want to talk about it doesn't mean I don't love you. Oh, honey, I love you so much. We'll get through this, okay? I gotta go. I'll call you on my way home. Hey, hey, Miles. Pete. Hey, um, sorry I'm late, man. Oh, no, no, I'm just glad you're here. All right, so, um, what can I do to help? Why don't you start just by, uh, getting comfortable with the place. Uh, meet a few people. You know what? Everybody loves coffee. Coffee? All right. And I'll be back in a little while to check on you. Is that cool? Yeah. Oh, don't worry about Mr. Hodges. He doesn't bite. Much. You sure? Coffee? Thanks. Need help? Not unless you know what the hell a quark is. It's a subatomic particle. You know, the building block of protons, neutrons, hadrons? Subatomic? It fits. Good one, kid. Piece of junk. <laughs> oh, hell. Damn hunk of junk. Uh, you mind if I take a look? Huh? Oh, we have a couple of CRTs at school. I know how to fix these when CR they're... CR what, what? No, no, you just gotta smack it. Up time. Get it. Go! Or, could be a loose coax cable. <sighs> all right, all right. Be my guest, huh, Mr... Smarty pants. Hey, please, go ahead. Tributes continue to pour in for Officer Jefferson Davis, the hero killed in the City Hall bombing, as reports emerge that he used his own body to shield others in his last moments of life. Hey, hey new kid. I'm empty here. Rio and son Miles, as well as brother Aaron. In addition to the hero. Man didn't do nothing heroic except get himself blown up. Hey, Ernie. I see you've met Miles. He's going to be helping out around here. You may have heard of his father, Jefferson Davis. Pretty great that even though he's got a lot of stuff going on right now, he decided to come and volunteer. Don't you think? Uh, yeah, yeah. Um, thanks. Uh, listen, Ked, I'm, I'm... Sorry about your dad. Come on, Miles. Let's see if Ant-Man needs a hand in the kitchen.
Hey, May. I gotta take off, but, uh, brought some help for you. Hi, Miles. Nice to see you. Well, grab an apron, wash your hands, and I'll show you around. Hey, hey Peter. Um, thanks for that back there. Of course. Almost noon. Sable should be moving Dr. Michaels. Better get to the Bowery and locate him. God, grant me some strength. Job by now. Way to have the kids back. Hey, Yuri. I'm heading to the Bowery to make sure Michaels gets to his new safe house. You know, safely. I wouldn't do that. Silver Sable made it clear you are not welcome. Yeah, well, what's she gonna do? Shoot me? Honestly, 50-50 chance. Ah, fine. I'll be in the neighborhood, but not too close. Just in case. Okay, be straight with me. If this devil's breath gets loose in the city, what's our worst-case scenario? 